American journalist, cartoonist, and author Jacob Paul Tapper was born on the 12th of March, 1969 in New York City and is perhaps most famous as a CNN TV anchor and chief Washington correspondent. He is also the host of CNN's weekday television news show, The Lead with Jake Tapper, as well as State of the Union. Have you ever wondered how much wealth this popular TV personality has accumulated so far? How rich is Jake Tapper? According to Celebrity.Money, it is estimated that the total amount of Jake Tapper's net worth is $5 million as of mid-2017. Acquired largely through his broadcast journalism career, which has been active since 1998. Jake Tapper was born to Helen Ann, a psychiatric nurse, and Theodore S. Tapper, a professor of pediatrics. He was raised in Philadelphia in the Jewish faith and attended Akiba Hebrew Academy in Marion, Pennsylvania, before enrolling at Dartmouth College in Hanover, New Hampshire, from which he graduated magna cum laude with a bachelor's degree of arts in history. Jake Tapper then began serving as a Democratic congressional candidate, Marjorie Margolis Mazvinsky's campaign press secretary, which engagement provided the basis for Tapper's net worth. The next step in Jake's career was at Powell Tate, a Washington, D.C. public relations firm, followed by a brief engagement at Handgun Control, Inc., or Brady Center, to prevent gun violence, as is referred to now. In 1998, Tapper took his first serious steps towards journalism when he began serving as a full-time senior writer for the Washington City Paper. For the latter engagement, Jake Tapper was rewarded with a Society of Professional Journalists Award. These ventures certainly made a positive impact on his overall net worth. Between 1999 and 2002, Jake Tapper served as a Washington correspondent for David Talbot's liberal web portal, Salon.com. During this time, he also worked as CNN's Take 5 talk show host, as well as a writer for the New York Times Magazine, The New Yorker, The Washington Post, and The Weekly Standard. Some of his articles were included in the Best American Political Writing in 2002. All these achievements helped Jake Tapper to establish himself in the dynamic world of journalism and to significantly increase his net worth. In 2003, Jake Tapper joined the ABC News, serving consistently until the day after the 2008 presidential election, when he was named Senior White House Correspondent, and for his efforts, he was honored with the Merriam Smith Award for presidential coverage three years in a row, from 2008 to 2010. Jake was also a regular contributor to ABC's Nightline, World News Tonight, and Good Morning America. Also, he conducted some exclusive interviews, including featuring CIA Director Liam Panetta, Vice President Joe Biden, as well as President Barack Obama himself. It is certain that all these accomplishments contributed positively to Jake Tapper's professional career, as well as his fortune. In 2012, Jake Tapper transferred to CNN. Besides continuing his Washington correspondence duty, he started hosting his own newscast, The Lead with Jake Tapper. The popular news opinion blog Mediate subsequently characterized Jake Tapper as one of the most respected TV anchors in cable news. And for hosting The Lead, Jake Tapper was rewarded with three national headliner awards. He also covered Osama bin Laden's death, the Iraq War, Hurricane Katrina, and the Boston Marathon bombing. Jake was involved in several current election candidate debates and interviews, too. Apart from his TV hosting and journalism, Jake Tapper is also an acclaimed author, with three published books so far, Body Slam, The Jesse Ventura Story, Down and Dirty, The Plot to Steal the Presidency, and The Outpost, which have added somewhat to his net worth. When it comes to his personal life, Jake Tapper has been married since 2006 to Jennifer Marie Brown, with whom he currently resides in Washington, D.C., with their two children.